It's a pleasure to welcome you to a hands-on introduction to engineering simulations. I really appreciate your interest in the course. In this course, you will be learning fundamentals alongside ANSYS. ANSYS is a very powerful commercial simulation tool that's used by professionals. We'll be using ANSYS as a problem-solving tool to solve interesting problems and real applications. We'll also use it as a learning tool to understand the fundamentals. The course uses a common approach to two popular solution techniques, FEA or finite element analysis and CFD or computational fluid dynamics. And by taking a common approach to these two, you, s you can see them as variations on a similar theme. We will also take a common approach to different physics. Um, the physics considered are structural mechanics, fluid dynamics, and heat transfer. The material is drawn from five courses in mechanical engineering at Cornell University. And we can range across courses and across physics um, through the use of the ANSYS simulation tool. This is useful to see how these different physics fit together because nature is multiphysics. The, we will, this, you'll be learning by doing, and the course is organized around ANSYS case studies. We have three FEA case studies, one in conduction and two in structural mechanics. And the Second structural mechanics module has been developed with, uh, in collaboration with Andy Sadwani at SpaceX. So it shows you fundamentals, it shows you, uh, it involves the learning of ANSYS, and it also involves the learning of industry practice. So it's a very exciting module, as are the others. We'll do two CFD case studies, and we'll do one case study that involves CFD and FEA, the coupling of the two. This will show you one-way fluid structure interaction. So this coupling, you know, you'll, you'll transfer the loads from the CFD to, to do an, um, a structural analysis with FEA. The case studies have been tested on ANSYS version 16. And when you get the free download, make sure you're getting version 16.2 because that's the version that's been tested on. And when we provide you with the geometry, um, it may not work with earlier versions. And we have also not tested it with uh, version 17, which is a re recent release. In addition to the ANSYS case studies, there are big idea sections the first one is what's under the black box, where I talk about how do you frame the simulation so that you look at it like an expert. And this framing is what we will use when we look at uh, you know, what's under the black box in the ANSYS case studies. There are also big idea sections on FEA and CFD. Uh, and these are you know have been developed from the perspective of the code user. Um, and I've used a just-in-time approach. It's like, what do you really need to understand about FEA and CFD to know what's happening under the black box when you're going through the ANSYS case studies? There are also big idea sections on solid mechanics and fluid dynamics, um, which are meant to help you understand the equations. You know, what, what are the physical principles contained in the equations that we'll be solving in ANSYS and what are the assumptions contained in those equations? And to give it's geared to give you an intuitive feel. So by going through the case studies and going through the big ideas, uh, you should be able to learn how to move beyond garbage in, garbage out, move beyond just pushing buttons, and start thinking like an expert.